All right, guys. A couple people want to know the benefit of this remote and what I actually use on it. I'm a simple guy, man. I don't know a lot about this sort of stuff. Big mouse pad, volume up and down, pause, um, rewind, fast forward. That's like 15 seconds. The OK, picture it like a, a left mouse button. This thing is Android based, so here's your left mouse button right here. Here's your right mouse button. The right mouse button basically means like the back button on your internet browser. This E button takes you to that screen from no matter where you're at. The H button or the home button that takes you to the internet. E button takes you to that screen. So before you start doing anything, guys, go over here to this little icon. Oops, see I clicked the wrong thing. So I'm gonna hit the back button, right? But I'm double clicking on that. It's got a speed test built into this thing, right? I just ran it, but you can you know restart your test, whatever you want. It does your speed test right there. You're looking for 15 or above. If it's below that, you're probably not going to have good results with this thing. All right. So now I'm going to go over here to XBMC, and all I'm going to do is double click the mouse button. Right. Everything I watch is in videos. I watch Go TV. I watch Go Movies. Right. That's you know obviously there's a lot of guys with sports stuff. You come over here to this little star thing. Click that. Here's your NFL streams, whatever, and you can scroll down here. Here's your Pack Network, Major League Baseball, Dragon streams. I'm going to get into all that later in a subsequent video. Stacy's in a hurry. She's going to take the kids to school, and we'll do that later tonight. But here's a Go TV, right? Oops. Right mouse button to get rid of that. Go TV, double click. It's going to bring up this little menu, right? If my kids want to watch cartoons, I go to genres. And you can search and find whatever cartoon you want. But I'm just going to go to genres. I'm going to go to animation. And these are like cartoon TV shows. If you go to movies, you go to genres, animation, and it's going to bring up a whole bunch of animated movies. So, you know, here's, here's all your different, you know, stuff here. With, you know, South Park, Futurama, whatever. SpongeBob SquarePants. And you can scroll down this big list. Or you can go find a show that they want to watch, right? So I'm clicking the right mouse button to go back. I'm going to popular now, double clicking the mouse button again. This working thing, it's annoying as hell, but it's part of the deal, man. This is not cable, and, but you're not paying for cable. So you go over here to Game of Thrones, or let's go to Sons of Anarchy, right? I double click Sons of Anarchy. You know, you select your season again. This, I mean, this stuff is not rocket science. I don't understand why people are saying this thing is hard to use. It doesn't seem that difficult to me. My wife uses it every morning. You pick your episode, whatever episode you want to watch. The next thing it's going to do, you're going to deal with that working button again. The next thing it's going to do is pull up a list of servers. We're going to select a server. It's going to start playing. And then I'm going to show you how to fast forward, rewind, and, and get in and out of it. So in the meantime, I am going to tell you guys quickly, this box is way temperamental. It, it was bulletproof for me for the first 10 or 12 days that we had it. This is just me selecting a server here, so I'm going to pick whichever one the top one is. For some reason, I saw Dave before he was selecting the lower ones. So back to the temperamental thing. I took this thing down to Parker. We had a slower internet speed, and we got a lot of... Uh, Previously on Sons of Anarchy. Sorry, let me turn that down. So we had a lot of slower internet speeds, and it was dropping them, and those are like, they turn into corrupt files. You get like four or five corrupt files, and it corrupts that box, and it turns into a total nightmare. You gotta like re reload XBMC and stuff. It's not impossible to do. Uh, once you get walked through it once with somebody, you can do it. Uh, but you, you, there's no possible way you're ever gonna figure that stuff out on your own. But I did write a list, and I'm gonna show somebody how to do that later tonight. So Mike Brown says, you know, how do you fast forward or whatever? You know, you can click on that. See, it's going faster. I can click on it again, and it's going even faster. You know, there's your whatever speeds or whatever you want, right? But the way that I do it. Is I just take the mouse pad and I go over here to, you know, if I want to go over here, I just click there, let it buffer, you know, and there it is. So that's how I fast forward rewind. So now let's get out of this real quick. I'm going to show you guys one last thing. Stacy's got to go. Rewind, 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 right? We're going to go back here. I'm going to go. Uh, here's your Go Movies if you want to watch movies. Here's your mashup thing, which if you guys know what mashup is, use it. If you don't know what mashup is, stay out of it. So you go in here. Here's all your add-ons again. Oops, that's one too many times. So here's all your here's all your apps or whatever, right? Dragon Streams is where your pay-per-view stuff is. 
This is like uh, Sports Devils, where I found you know the NFL stuff. This is your porn right here. This is your live TV stations right there. Let's say you don't want to do with any of that stuff. You can go over here. I, did I already show that earlier in this video? This thing. You click okay, that. Good. Here's your NFL whatever stuff over here. Right mouse button goes away. I mean, that, that's it. If you can't find your show or whatever, there's other apps that you can go into, but so far I find everything in here. That's about it.